Prescott gets it complete as Cooper takes it all the way. It's a good play design right here. The Giants are in zone coverage to clear out Cobb in front, and then Cooper coming across the field. And what a throw by Dak. Hit him in stride. That's all set up. Won by the pass protection of the Cowboys offense. In the spring post-draft. And now Prescott with a lot of time and an easy connection to Amari Cooper. And Amari Cooper, remember, was traded mid-season last year. Pass is caught by Cooper. And as you said, they're also without Akeem Hicks. One of the best defensive linemen in the NFL. In a... Bukowski coming on a blitz, and this one up in the air, and dropped right into the lap of Cooper for the touchdown. Tolliver out there in coverage, Sky into the lap of Cooper, and he was ruled to be inbounds and in the end zone, and he was. That's a great job. North Turner used to always call a throw like this right down the stovepipe. I mean, that ball, he was in pretty good coverage, Tolliver was. I mean, he's right on top of Amari Cooper. That thing had to be dropped out of the sky, right on top of him. And Four-man rush. Prescott floats it for Cooper. Hits him in stride. Cooper stays in bounds for the touchdown. Wow. one-on-one -on -one. I'm a little surprised by the coverage quite honestly but he just gets taken to school and Amari Cooper able to fight through that doesn't make the tackle overruns it there and a touchdown and that's the the, the one thing that the Packers are just trying not to do is give up a, a quick score but they're giving him a one-on-one -on -one outside with a safety in the middle with no help knowing the Cowboys have to throw the football themselves in the foot and that one. Prescott side Second down of 46. Scott down the sideline, and the pass is incomplete. Out of bounds was Amari Cooper. Good coverage by Alexander. Yet again, they were stride for stride. Team-point hole for this Cowboys offense, and Prescott wide open is Amari Cooper, and so far the Packers have not been able to cover number 19. Well, last week the Packers, when they faced the two tight end set, they stayed pretty much six defensive backs, knowing the Cowboys and their ability to run the football just like the Eagles were able to do. Two on that pass, and now play action from Prescott over the middle, has a man for a first down, Cooper. Twenty-five first down. Prescott down the middle has Cooper. Another big play. Prescott and one-on-one -on -one goes to Cooper for the touchdown against the rookie Baker. Zach uses hard count. He recognizes that the Giants are coming, and he knows he's got one-on-one -on, -one on the outside with Amari Cooper, as good a route runner as there is in all of football, against the rookie, DeAndre Baker. It's just, it's... Here comes the blitz. Prescott hangs in there. Fires caught. Cooper to the 30-yard line. Makes it third down and 12. Prescott up in the pocket throws and that is Amari Cooper making the catch and incredibly staying inbounds at the 30 yard line 20 yards it was amazing it went right over Mike Hughes's head like he didn't even see the thing double check I would say yes wouldn't you in attempts for 40 yards second down and nine look out Prescott avoids the sack. Griffin chases him. Fires down the field. Caught! Amari Cooper. Credit Prescott. You got Hunter going after him. You got uh, simply a shotgun and a fake by Prescott, who rolls and looks and throws and directs traffic. And that one is 
<laughs> a touchdown again for Cooper. How does he do it time after time? May have contracts for both of them tomorrow. That's magical because you can't defend that, right? That ball is three yards outside the boundary, and they are just timing it up perfectly on the outside. In the game, a tailback on a third down. It's blocked up well. Prescott guns it. It's caught for a first down right over the middle, and what a strike. That time it was Amari Cooper as the Coop chance come down here in Maryland. Hard score. Here's Prescott on second down and over the middle. Touchdown, and it's Cooper for six. That was too easy. Got to get a stop to start this half, but with this protection that the Dallas offensive line is giving Dak Prescott, he's throwing essentially out of the rocking chair, as they like to say. And DeShazer Everett is playing a lot more on defense than he normally does. A college that has something to do with it. He feels that they've gotten away with some pass interference. Prescott out to his right, throws, passes, caught. Cooper. Going for a side. Oh, and it somehow gets through and it's caught to Cooper. Slay thought he had another one. And there was no one in front of him if he hauled it in. How to slay all the way to the top of you. Barnett is back in the game. A double shoulder shake and then downfield and it's caught by Amari Cooper. For a big game, the two-minute warning is upon us. The crowd saluting one out of seven. It'll be three and four, which the loser will be after the nice game. And that pass along the sideline is hauled in. Amari Cooper, what a catch. Did you see the late burst there from Amari Cooper? He basically, Jalen Mills was way in front of him, and he just hit the Jets and ran past him and caught up to that football. He is just such a difference maker. The running game's better. The passing game's better. Watch this little burst. Get it. Start, they've been red hot, and they will fake the run on play pass. Prescott going deep. He Pam, thanks. That's what they're trying to do now. Prescott to the end zone. Touchdown. It's another one for Amari Cooper. Watch the motion by Cooper coming back across the formation. This is a big wrinkle that Dallas has added to in their offense this year. A lot of that allows Dak Prescott to identify whether they're playing man or zone. He's able to read the coverage because of the movement by, Co by Cooper. And look at the eyes taking him right back to his primary target in a nice contested catch. Time, it's a wall, man open, Cooper has it at the 20, he's forced out of bounds at the 19 yard line. It's Amari Cooper, he's having himself a day. Couple of touchdowns, that's already his sixth catch for 88 yards. Game, he has 31 yards already. Prescott, a lot of time, throws, complete touchdown, but a flag, it's Cooper. And let's see what the penalty flag is, see if it stands. And working against the best corner of Miami, Xavier Howard. Excellent footwork and body movement by Amari Cooper. That draws the hold from Howard, but he's still able to break away and get plenty of separation. Here's a second and seven. And a completion for the first. Gain of 17 for Cooper. Wide to the right, Prescott's going to fire it and hit it. There's Cooper. And Tony, you said they got to get Cooper involved in this game after no catches last Sunday. Free play. Prescott wants to air it out and now does. Looking for Cooper. He's got it inside the 20. Well, started with the Cowboys going to a hurry up there on third down. It could totally confused the Redskins. That penalty is declined. The result of the play is a first down. Totally confused the Redskins. They've got help over the top. Kenny Ladler, who was just brought up this week, he plays that about as bad as you can play it as a safety. Prescott throws. Pass caught. Cooper. 
Broke a tackle and a good play on first down as Amari Cooper gets 21. I think it's important. Here's Cooper making a catch and a move and a spin out to the 39. I, 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 now look, I, I can.